I'm Kate and welcome to this Everything £5 Try On Haul. So I hope you're okay. Sending love to everyone. Hope you had a nice week and I um, hope you have a lovely weekend. So I've got loads to show you in this haul. I've got a huge cardboard box. It's so huge I can barely lift it. Arrgh. So I've got loads of treasure in here to show you. All kinds of things. Most of it though is kind of loungy wear. Well, comfy clothes. So things to wear around the house and some lovely slippers and things to wear when I go on walks and stuff. So I've got loads of amazing bargains to show you. And I just want to say at the start, you probably saw in the title, it says ad. So this video is sponsored. It's been sponsored obviously by everything five pounds and I was given a voucher to spend as well. So I was given a um, hundred pound voucher, a voucher for a hundred pounds to spend on the website. And I looked through the website looking for treasure and I found some amazing things. I love doing these videos, genuinely love having a look on the website and then showing you what I find and then what it looks like on because you don't know, do you sometimes when you see things online, how they're going to fit. So where I can try them on, I will. So yeah, before I go any further though, I've said hello and hope you're okay. Just going to do my mug of the day, which is sitting here and it's one of my favourite ones. They're all my favourite mugs, but I think this is one of the ones I particularly love and I got this ages ago. It says happy. It's got a really cute little design. And it's kind of irregular shaped, got little bumps all over it. And on the back, oh, that's Rufus having a snore. He's just sitting next to me. Um, really cute little patterns on it. And this is my mug of the day. And just in case you were wondering, the jumper I'm currently wearing was also from Everything Five Pounds. I think it was a couple of hauls ago. So maybe from the November one, but I'll link my previous Everything Five Pounds uh, five pounds hauls in the description box in case you want to watch them after this one so yeah this was from the website and i also got like a salmon -y one and i love them i regularly wear these and this has got like it's white but with a sort of glittery goldy fleck in it fleck did i just say did i just no i'm sure i said fleck i hope i did anyway right i'm going to shut up talking about what i'm wearing and show you what is in my huge box oh got some pajamas as well so i'm going to start off with this lovely jumper and it's dark gray as you can see here so everything i got is just kind of cozy and warm because um spending so much time indoors obviously because we're still um we're still locked down here in the uk so everything is kind of apart from a couple i've got one thing for lee um I got him a little, I got him a shirt actually. So apart from that, everything else is cosy and comfy. Things I can wear around the house and items I can wear out when we go for our walks because it's just been freezing recently. So this is just a really nice dark grey jumper and it's got this turtleneck thing. I do love a high neck. So this has got like a, it's called a cowl neck, isn't it? I wasn't sure what it was called my last haul. Um, yeah, and I really, it just keeps me really cosy. I do love these jumpers. So I love a high neck and that has a turtleneck. Rufus is having a good old snore. Hello, he's just sitting here. Um, and it was from what well, just says, M N Knit. I think it's M N Knit. So there's all kinds of different makes on everything five pounds. So it's interesting to see where they come from. You don't always know. Uh, but this is a size medium. Sometimes it says, and sometimes the label's been cut out. So this is a size medium, and it's nice and big. It goes in at the bottom. And the arms look nice as well so i shall try that on a little bit later so you can see what it looks like i do love a cozy jumper so that'll be perfect for now around the house if i go on a walk under a jacket and in the future when life gets back to normal i can wear that i got this pajama set as well so this was five pounds and you get a top and um, pajama bottoms and a little eye mask thing which you could use as a hairband i think i'd use that more as a for what i'd use that more as a hairband than an eye mask i think because i don't really wear eye masks um but i know some people obviously do so five pounds for this set i really like the pattern i think it's really cute oh by the way if you like anything during this haul everything will be linked below in the description box hello rufus he's getting comfy so everything's linked which is brilliant so if you like the pajama set if you like I've got some socks to show you. So anything you like will be linked below and it'll take you straight to the website um, so you can have a look. If it's not linked below, it's normally sold out. So just to let you know. And anyway, back to pajamas. So some lovely pajamas. Uh, I really like the pattern. They're just kind of peachy and white with little hearts on it. It says love you. And there's quite a lot of stretch to these as well. So there's some give in these pajamas. And it's got a cuffed bottom. And if you watch my videos, you'll, you might know that I, love, I do love a cuffed bottom. I love a cuff. Right, and then the top is like this. They're the bottoms. 
and the top is just quite simple with a little heart the same color this lovely peachy color and it says do what you love give it your give it your all do what you love and what else what else do you say you are sorted you oh no you're saved in my saved you're saved in my saved so some nicer some nice mottos on there and then of course the hairband I band thing and I added some socks to my order as well I remembered that I needed some socks and they do huge packets of five pounds and in here there's eight pairs of socks they're really cute actually so all kinds of different colors in my sock packet so five pounds for that and I needed some socks because I'm doing a lot more home workouts and I've got lots of fluffy socks but I needed some simple socks so I got those and then I picked this up for Lee it's a really nice shirt oh Rufus is having a snore and I had a look on the men's section of everything five pounds so I always try and find Lee some stuff because he's extra large there's not like loads of things but I saw this and thought actually that's really nice and then Lee had a look and he chose this as well so um yeah I got this shirt for him it's just a really nice kind of denim-y was it cotton let's have a look what do you say on the inside shirt and then he looked at it and went oh that's nice it just says here jack south london and it's a hundred percent cotton washed with similar colors so it's a really nice pale bluey gray i think with a white pocket lovely buttons and then at the bottom it just says approved standard jack south and lee also chose this hat as well it's a really simple beanie hat that he can wear when we go for our walks because it's really cold at the moment so it's a nice kind of What's that? It's just brown, isn't it? Different shades of brown with a little turn up. And on the inside, it's fleecy, which is brilliant. So it's going to keep him really cozy. So yeah, nice fleecy beady hat. I'll just put it on like that. It doesn't suit me. I like the ones with the pom-poms on. I think I've got one or two in here anyway. So a nice, oh, it's really cozy though. A lovely hat for Lee. And the next thing I'm going to show you looks like the most coziest jumper ever. It's lovely. And I thought it looked really nice on the website. So it's this hoodie. I love this colour, this kind of like pale, it's not mint green. It's almost like a washed out green. I love the colour. And it is so soft. If you could touch this, you'd know how soft it is. It's really cozy. It's like fleecy on the inside and it's really nice. I absolutely love this jumper. And I, it looks so nice on the website. I got two of them. So I thought, I think that jumper's going to be amazing. And this is the type of thing I love wearing around the house. So I, I sleep in this as well. So it's like pajamas that you can wear around the house. And if someone, you know, I don't know, not that anyone's coming around at the moment, but if I was to wear it out, it'd look fine because it's just a hoodie, but it's just so comfortable. And I love the detail. So if you just have a look, it's really nice down here, like just like a normal jumper sleeve. But look at this bit here. It's split at the side, so it's not going to cling. And I really like how that looks. Just, I don't know what you'd call that, but that's how it looks at the bottom. I love it, I really love it. And I'm so glad I got two of them. I did do a, an Everything Five Pounds haul in the summer, or just before the summer, I think it was like last, must have been last year. And I got a bright pink hoodie and I wear that all the time. So this is gonna be another one that I wear all the time. Um, what size are they? Actually, let me show you this. So it just says Ocean Drive, size large. And is there anything else on the inside? But obviously I don't know where it's from, but that's the make. It's just so cozy. If you can see like the fleecy stuff, it's lovely. And it says 60% cotton, 40% polyester. Love that. It looks nice and big and cozy. And I'll show you what that looks like when I try it on. Love that the jumper. And I just got another one. I'm so glad I did because it's great. Got some more pajamas. So some more five pound pajamas. So that's the little thing you can put over your eyes or use as a headband. And then I got these because they've got mugs of the day all over them. So have a look at these. So the same as the other ones, five pounds a set with the mugs of the day on them, a nice stretchy waistband. So I'm sure they're going to fit. These are a size. They'll be, oh, extra large. So I wouldn't say they're extra large. I'd say they were, a, I'd say they're a medium. But yeah, I did get the extra large size because I thought they might come up small. And yeah, they've just got loads of little mugs of the day on them, smiling. Hello. And then again, cuffed bottom. That's the hairband, noseband thing. And then uh, that's the top. And it just says 11 a.m. 11 a.m. Wake up early. 11 a.m. isn't early. Well, that is a proper lie in. That's really late. I used to wake up at 11 a.m. when I was younger. I loved it when I was like 20 and I used to sing in the evening and then sleep in till 11. But yeah, nowadays, I think I'm waking up around eight in the morning. 
that's the time, which is, I don't know, it's not a bad time. It's not early, early, is it? But it's just perfect. And I can stay up a bit later in the evening and watch telly with Lee and then get a little bit of a lie in. Last lockdown, well, the first proper big lockdown, I was getting up at six, six in the morning because it just felt right and I wanted to get a head start to the day. But nowadays I'm just like lying in till eight or sometimes half eight, not 11. Or is that saying wake up early? Not 11, but there's no not on it. Anyways, the little donut, he looks like he's having a yawn and there's this nice, happy, smiley mug. So some more pajamas and that hairband, headband, noseband thing. I picked up two lovely, snuggly bobble hats. One is mustard yellow with some little sequins on and this one is kind of knitted charcoal. No, it's black, isn't it? It's not charcoal. It's black with a pom-pom on the top, but it's got like a really nice um knitted pattern on it if you can see quite a subtle one so two hats for me um because we go on our walks um most days to the beach or to the park or wherever and obviously i wear a nice snuggly hat because it's chilly and i've i haven't been washing my hair too much over this lockdown i've just literally i washed it today for the video because i'd look like a scruff bag but um normally i just plait my hair plait these two and then shove on a bobble hat and then go for a walk so that's been that's been my lockdown hairstyle two plaits um just because it's easy and then bobble hat oh i'm gonna sneeze hang on one minute <laughs> that's probably the weirdest sneeze i think i've ever sneezed i'm gonna keep that sneeze in though because someone said oh i wish like i edited a sneeze out whenever it was and someone's like i wish you kept your sneeze in so there's a sneeze of the day for you sorry if you didn't like my sneezing oh anyway back to the hat I think that looks great. I love that. I do love a hat. And this has got fleece on the inside as well. And I'm wear I've been wearing a few different hats lately. I've got a white one, but I keep getting makeup all over it. So black is probably better. And on the inside, it's just really nice fleece, really cozy. Um, I don't know where that's from. Do you say anything? It just says black noir with a lovely little pom-pom on it. I don't think I have a black hat, actually. I think I've got... A... No, I haven't got a black hat. I might have a grey one, but yeah, a really nice cosy hat. Um, so I shall wear that when we go for our walks. And then this one as well. Um, well, it doesn't, doesn't say anything on it. It's just mustard yellow, a nice pom-pom. And on the inside, look at this. Look how snuggly that is. So soft and snuggly. I haven't got, like, hats this warm, I don't think. I've got ones that have, like, a band that go around, a nice fleecy band on the inside of my hat. But I haven't got one that there's fleece all the way inside. This is great. That's going to be so snuggly. Oh, I really like that. I do love a hat. I think these are the only hats I suit. I don't suit baseball caps. I don't suit any other caps. But I think these, I think I do suit these. I think anyway. Yeah, that is really snuggly and over the ears. Love that. So, um, yeah, I shall be wearing this uh, soon for our walk. So I want to keep it on. That's the only thing with hats. You put them on and you never want to take them off, do you? Because they're so snuggly. Um, I got some gloves as well. So these are going to be for our when we go on our walks. And I didn't realise, but these are mobile phone gloves. Not mobile phone gloves, but you can, if you have your phone, if you take some pictures, you can keep them on and use your phone, which I didn't realise. I just thought they were really pretty warm gloves. I do have some... One pair of really warm gloves. Gloves keep disappearing though. And then I end up with Toby's football gloves for some reason. Like the ones I bought him that say ball foot instead of football. So I've ended up with those. But these are really nice. So I'm going to keep these as my little posh gloves for our walk. And let's have a look. There's a little pom-pom there. Little like soft pom-pom. And I'll put my hand inside here. Oh, they're so, so snuggly. Aren't they lovely? Really nice little gloves. And the fact you can use your phone. Oh, look, there's a little bit there that you can use to do your phone with. Hang on, I'll put the other one on and then you can see. So, yeah, that must be the mobile phone access to your mobile phone. Boop, and then it works. So you can take pictures because normally if I take some pictures, I have to take a glove off and then get my phone out. And that hand gets really cold. So when I've been, I did do some vlogging the other day and I was on the beach and I was really cold so this would be really handy for when I do some filming or take pictures so that must be the activation bit so they're lovely and the inside I'll just show you really soft as you can see there look Rufus do you like my new gloves oh they nice he doesn't care so yeah they were five pounds as well and I think they're brilliant especially the fact that um 
they you can touch your mobile phone so i got those i put those in my pile i've got a few things to try on here oh i, don't, I better take my hat off i don't want to though it's so snuggly we're going for a walk later so I'll, I'll pop it back on i think actually it's warmer that one's warmer than that one so just to let you know that's slightly thicker but they're both lovely this jumper is great as well so i did say i, I loved um i had that big pink velvet hoodie that i got last year from from everything five pounds and this is quite similar it's exactly the same color it's a bright pink jumper and it is so snuggly it's another roll neck polo neck jumper because this is all i want to wear at the moment like a, anything with a either a hood or a roll neck so either way it's going to keep me snuggly and this is a really nice jumper so it looks really good quality and i think it might be a primark jumper i think i've got it in a medium what size are you I think it's a medium, but the label's been cut out. Yeah, it is medium. But is that Primark, do you reckon? That to me looks like a, a Primarky thing. And it's just really soft and squidgy. It's got a bit of a pattern on it, if you can see, like a slight pattern. And the bottom's quite loose, as you can see there. I'll try it on in a bit. And then the sleeves have a nice little um, like turn up bit here. They're quite open, so they're not cuff they're kind of open so i'll show you what that looks like on but really lovely big snuggly warm jumper i love that um yeah i haven't got anything dressy in here i just literally bought things that i can wear right now and for the next few months i told you i loved a polo neck i've got another one here this is a black jumper with a white stripe on it and it's actually a little bit shorter in the body than i realized but this might be one you tuck in so it looks quite short to me how you know here when i hold it up but when i try it on it might be completely different it might work so we shall see when i try it on um so it's a really nice cozy uh, polo neck jumper as i said i do love a polo neck the sleeves are nice and long and they go they go in yes yeah, slightly go in at the bottom and that's all i can say about it really it's just a nice polo neck thick jumper like a knitted jumper and i'll see if it says anything what do you say here this says uk 12 what it says there and i think the label is there a label in this one no there's not in this one so i'll show you what that looks like um when i try it on but that might be a, a tuck in your jeans or your skirt or something so yeah these look really good so the other day we we're going to go for a walk and i nearly i really wanted to wear these but i was like no nope, gotta wait for the haul and i wanted to wear the hats and then i really wanted to put these on the other day but i had to wait because i thought you've got to i've got to show you stuff first and then wear it but i did nearly put these on so these look oh they look a bit mm, i'll try them on they look a tiny bit small but hopefully they'll be okay so i've seen these in um i don't know i have definitely seen this make in shops before super soft with grippers get cozy with cozies ladies sherpa slippers slip into some winter luxury with these extra soft comfortable indoor slippers from cozies so there's one pair i'll just pull that off and i shall try i'll try this one on they look really nice, they don't they? They look so snuggly. I'll roll first, a little bow on the back. Right, I'm going to try this one on. I've got some really thick socks on at the moment, so I'll take those off. And I'm going to put that on and let you know. Oh no, they're lovely. They fit really nicely. I've actually got pyjama bottoms on at the moment. <laughs> this is my look at the moment, pyjama bottoms and some kind of a pyjama -y slash jumper top. They're really snuggly. I'm a size six, so I think if you're a seven, they might be um, too, this is a strange angle. I think if you were size seven, they might be too small. So I'd say these are more of a four, 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 size four to six. If you're size four to six, these might be the ones for you. Lovely, they feel really snugly. I'm actually gonna keep those on. I'll take the other sock off and then put the other one on because it's, oh, I'll get that off. Put them on because they're super cozy. Okay, so I've got those on. They are lovely. Oh, that's really snuggly and warm. And it's got gripper on the bottom so you don't slip over. I've just shoved everything here in a big pile. And then at the end of this video, this part of the video, I'll do a try on to show you what they look like. And then I'll hang them up and put them in my wardrobe. So I have been doing some more, lots of exercise at home. Since December, I think since the start of December, I've started to do a lot more exercise. And um, yeah, I've been really good. So I've been making, making sure I do 10,000 steps at least and some kind of exercise class as well most days. So I got a few little bits that I could wear while I'm doing my little workouts at home. I got some of these Capri 
capri pant things because I thought they looked really good and these are a size large they've got a nice um large waistband which will be make me feel nice and secure I don't like it when you get a small waistband and then it like it digs in doesn't it and you get like not a very good silhouette so I think these will be quite flattering on I will show you and they are NVC I got a top actually in the last or yeah I think it was my last everything five pounds haul that's quite similar to this so I could wear that as a little set so they just feel like really good quality sports pants I don't know if that's, that's the right saying but you know what I mean active wear so yeah I got these and I have been wearing I got some years ago and I, I've worn them so many times they keep breaking though so these will hopefully replace them and then to go with that I've got this kind of sports bra thing that was also five pounds obviously because it's an everything five pounds haul so this is NBC it's like a really nice sports bra so I'll try this underneath something um and that's the back of it so you see in the front that's the back like a crisscross back and that looks really good as well so that'll be nice and supportive and this is a size I think it must be medium does it say size large so I got that in a large as well but like I said everything will be linked below so try that on in a bit and let you know how they feel I've got four more things to show you before I do the try on part of this haul and I did get some trainers for Toby um last year during one of these everything five pound hauls and he didn't end up wearing them but I love them so I wear them all the time they're just plain black trainers so I got some more because they were really nice actually I got some yellow ones as you can see so the previous ones I got were like black and they had a bit of glitter in them um so Toby didn't want to wear them but I love them they were size six so I got some more and these are obviously yellow they're really lightweight so they weigh hardly anything and I think I'm gonna get quite a lot of use out of these I don't really care about trainers I don't care that they're not a make I would have done when I was younger but I, I just don't care so as long as they feel nice that's that's all I hope that's all I can hope for I think they look great so they're bright yellow and I think they'll look really nice with with this kind of color so I've got some trainers they're size 6 size 39 and that is what they look like and I went for these boots as well so these are kind of like Ugg style boots leopard print with a good sturdy bottom and I think they look really nice they'll be great for going to the beach I'll you know shove my jeans on and wear these to the beach and for walks and they've got a nice little bow at the back so they were five obviously everything five pounds and then the inside is really cozy and warm so it's all fleecy on the inside and that lining I'll just take this out here the lining goes all the way to the bottom so you've got like this oh yeah here we go so the that, that bit is also lined as you can see so it's really soft all really soft fleecy lining so I'll just put that back um yeah so they look really lovely so I wear them on our walks and I got these in a size six shall I just try one on just in case I'll just tell you what the how they fit so I am definitely a size six in my in the feet department oh they feel quite big actually I would say they could be more of a size six and a half to seven. So yeah, these feel a little bit on the large side, but then I'll be putting a couple of pairs of socks on, so they'll probably be fine. So just to let you know, they're probably more of a six and a half, seven, I think. I'll try the other one. I've got one foot bigger than the other. I don't know why, since I had Toby years ago, my feet grew and oh yeah, they definitely feel bigger. So I would say, I would say they're a size seven, actually. They feel more like a seven. So I might, if I don't end up using these, Lee's sister's a seven, so I can give them to her and she can stomp around, you know, doing her walks with them on or wear them around the house. I got a pair of these for my dad. I got him some grey ones last time and I thought I'd pick him up some white ones as well. So they're for my dad. So you might have seen these on a previous um, Everything Five Pounds haul. Uh, I don't know what the make is, but they just say sport on the side. And I think they... um. I think they're great so my dad will wear them he wears them probably he'll probably wear them around the house so they are for him whenever i see him in the future at some point right so i've got some oh yeah hang on oh you might have seen a little glimpse of them so i took a bit of a gamble on these i thought they could be the what's it the wild card of the haul and i thought they looked really funny i got some bright red lobster slippers 
Hello, I'm a bright red lobster and so am I. So I think Toby's going to like these. I could obviously wear them, they're probably really warm, but I kind of thought actually they'd be funny for Toby. They were from New Look. So they were from New Look and originally they were £15.99 and they're obviously on the website, everything £5 for £5. Size medium, a five to six. Actually, it might be too small for Toby, I might have to wear these. I'm going to try one on, let you know what the size is like. That feels really good. So I've got the lobster on my foot. Feels very comfortable. I'll try the other one on as well. They're really comfortable. They're actually very cosy. So if Toby doesn't end up wearing these, I will. So I just thought I'd I'd go for something a bit different on one of the purchases, these crazy lobster slippers. So that, that's the, my final thing in the haul. I thought, well, if all else fails, they'll make us laugh. Little, metallic little um, snippers. What are they, claws? Yeah, metallic claws, snippers, pincers. Um, so that's my final thing. So that is everything I've got to show you in this haul. I'm now going to do the try-on part. So I'll quickly do that now so you can see what things look like. And just to let you know, the yellow trainers that are size six fit like a six. So they um, feel really nice, actually you feel really comfortable. So I just thought I'd share that with you because I forgot to say that earlier. Right, I'm going to tidy this up and try some things on. And the first thing I'm trying on is the grey jumper. So this is what it looks like on, if you can see here. It feels so comfortable, really nice. I love the neckline and I love how it fits. So it's sort of baggy, but then goes in at the bottom, um, which is actually really nice. So it's beneath, it's kind of on your hips where it goes in, so I think it's flattering. I think it looks really smart. It feels like really um, good quality material. And I've got it on with a pair of my old jeans, just in case you were wondering, what are you wearing on your bottoms? And it's time for this one. I knew this one would be lovely. And it fits exactly how I thought it would. It's just so comfortable, ridiculously comfortable, and so soft as well. Oh, it's quite low at the back, which is good. It covers your bum, just in case you're feeling a bit um, shy. Like, oh, don't wanna cut my bum. You know, we all have those days. So yeah, I really like it I and mean, I love it. I absolutely love this. So this is something I will wear like day in, day out. In fact, I've got two of them. This might be the only thing I'll wear. Now, of course I'll wear the other things, but I really love it. Now I've got the big polar neck jumper on and I was worried that it was too short, but actually, is it too short or does it look good? I thought it'd be like really short, but it fits, it fits, um, it fits really nicely. I think it looks quite, flattering weirdly like I'd never buy this shape normally but I actually like it like sort of doesn't go in at the back either it's it's almost I don't know I don't even know how to describe it I like how the sleeves come back in they're nice and baggy but I actually think it's um quite flattering just looking in this mirror here what do you reckon it's quite a good length I think I don't know it's not clingy at all it's quite a big um cozy oversized oversized that's the word oversized jumper and i wouldn't normally buy anything like this or this shape because i think i thought i think i thought it wouldn't suit me but actually i really like it i think it's nice and cozy here the um polar neck part and yeah i think it's i think it's quite flattering what do you reckon this massive pink knitted if i can call it knitted chunky um really warm jumper so this is what it looks like again. It covers my bum. So if I'm having a shy day, oh, don't look at me. I can put this on and feel really comfy. It's really cozy. And I keep saying the word cozy over and over again, but it's so comfortable. I love it. I don't want to take it off, but I've got some other things to try on. So far, everything's been amazing. Even the jumper I thought would be too short, I love. And I really like this neckline polar neck it's really um it's a really cozy one it's not you know like the one I wore when I did the haul at the beginning that's a cowl neck but this one is just it won't let any heat out it's really warm so I think this is brilliant love it very very comfortable oh, by the way I've got my um oh sorry Ruth I'm just gonna stand here for a second I won't hurt you I promise he's just here I've got my um uh, slipper socks on these ones from earlier and they're really comfortable and the word of the day word of the day cozy so this is my outfit oh, I show you? i'll try and do a jump so you can see everything in one go yummy whoa i'm okay i'm okay i've now got the sports bra on and these capri pant things so i'll just stand up on here doing another rosy henshaw i didn't just blow off by the way that was the 
That was the sofa bed going blah. These bottoms feel really um, secure. In fact, there's a large waistband. They're not going to fall down or give me what it called, you know, like ripples or anything. So it feels really nice. The bra thing's good. Feels nice and supportive. It just feels so comfortable. So I could do like my house workouts wearing this. I love this outfit. I love this jumper. I think that's got to be my um, favourite thing, actually. Oh, Rufus, hello. I'm sorry I keep jumping up here. Are you okay? Okay. Right, so I've just got pyjamas to show you. And then that is it. So I'm going to shove on one pair of pyjamas because they're exactly the same. I've got the mug of the day ones on. They fit really nicely. Nice around the waist. Very comfortable. I like the mugs of the day on them. And probably what I normally do, I always wear the bottoms and then I put a different top on. So I think my ideal cosy outfit will be, oh, actually it's going to be this one. It would be this and these and this and these. So ultimate comfort for lockdown number three. So yeah, they are the pyjamas on. They are really comfortable. And that is everything I've got to show you in this haul. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you did give the video a like, make sure you subscribe and let me know what your favourite item was. What did you think um, looked nicest on or what did you think was the best value for money? There's so many wonderful things and I'm um, genuinely grateful. I couldn't think of the words then, but I'm very grateful. Rufus is snoring. He's like, this is boring. I know, I'm nearly finished. But I'm really grateful to everything five pounds for these videos because I love doing them. And I've got clothes that I'm going to feel really comfortable in at home for the next however long. So thank you very much to everything five pounds. And all the links will be in the description box. If anything you liked, have a look down there. And if it's not linked, it might have sold out. Um, so yeah, everything will be linked below. Thanks so much for watching and I'll speak to you soon. I'll be back on Friday. So in a week's time with another video. Come over to Instagram as well. I'm Kate McCabe on Instagram and I've got a house account called Kate's Homely Home and they will be linked below too. But have a lovely week. Have a great weekend. Take care. Stay safe. Lots of love. See you soon. Bye. And goodbye from Rufus as well who's had a lovely sleep during this video. Oh, a cool boy. I'll give you a gravy bone. Do you want a... Uh... Okay. Gravy bone time. Thanks for watching. Bye.